How's um Daddy Dan gonna play into the picture? You know, he was in prison. Yeah, Dan. Thing around I, his neck. You know, I think when we come back, everybody's sort of written Dan off, um, right. or at least tried to. And you just guys did at the party. Like, yeah, yeah like, it's pretty much you know like Dan, you're dead to us now. Mm -hmm. You've you've completely ruined you know a lot of people's lives, and mm -hmm. it's time to, it's time for you to go. And basically, he does go. He goes to prison, and um, when we come back, I think Nathan is really the only person that has any sort of investment. Okay. And Dan, because he is his father, right, right. and that bond is not easy to break. Right, right. And you know there is a grandson involved now. And he and, is a father. That's you know Nathan is always Nathan has always wanted so so much to see that good in his father, mm -hmm. and um, I think that it, there's still a little bit of that flame there for him. Okay. Um, that's going to be hard for him to overcome. Right. Now yeah. you're working with a four-year-old. How is that? Oh, working with with Jackson, who plays Jamie, right, is just right. amazing. He is so. So awesome. He's like this little ball of energy and he's so smart, you know. Uh -huh. He looks he looks a lot younger than he is. He's uh -huh. six, he plays four. Okay. But uh he's very smart, very sharp, very hard worker, and he just, you know, is so great around people. It's just it livens the setup. It's right. a completely different set when he's around. Right, right. And it's it's gotta be another challenge for you as an actor to play with your wife of four years, you know, uh, having played a high schooler, you know, mm -hmm. basically when, when we left and now yeah. what? Three, nine months later, maybe you're playing. You got four years with a wife. Yeah. How is that? How's that playing out so far in the episodes? I think you're um, ten into it, right? Yeah, it's it's been going as far as the relationship goes between Nathan and Haley and, and his son. It started off pretty poorly, actually. Um, mm. You know, because oh, okay. Nathan was in such a dark place, he really he really couldn't tend to the duties that he could, you know, he used to be able to around the house, and he wasn't being a good husband to his wife, and he wasn't being a good father to his. You know, kid drinking all the time right, and right. causing scenes, and you know, but so, he's got a lot of pain. Yeah, he's got a lot of pain to deal with, and so eventually, you know, he sort of works on that and tries to overcome that, and uh -huh. and things come back around for the relationship. But there's definitely a lot of pitfalls, you know, this season for that for that relationship. And is it is it a hard challenge for you to adapt this into that? Get in, go to those dark places um, as an actor. Yeah, that's always been the hardest for me is playing, you know, the the emotional stuff and really getting into. You do it you seamlessly. Know, the, the, things, the things that, it's, no. it's really, you know, it's tough to get into the things that we're scared to go, the places that we're scared to go in real life. You uh -huh, know? Right, and it's, right, nobody right. likes to sit there and cry or brood or be, you know, sad or angry. Okay. Um, but, you know, you do it as, as an actor and it's hard, mm -hmm. but it's definitely rewarding. And you guys have a lot of fans. And right. Fernanda would like to know about a dream character that you would like to play in your career that you haven't played yet. A dream Dance. character. I would love to play, I think I would love to play in a, like a World War II epic, oh, something like right. Band of Brothers yeah. or something like that. That okay. would always be, that's always been a dream. But that's heavy drama. Yeah, 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 it is, but again, worth it. Uh -huh. All right, exactly. Completely. Invest yourself in Yeah. That. Well, thank you, James. I've awesome. had a great time here on your set. Thank you for inviting us out here. And hit us up on the CW Source for more behind the scenes interviews here on the set of One Tree Hill. I'm Jason C. Bye bye. Thanks a lot.